Give it a read, I would say. This is a real good lesson. Anytime your opponent's two away, you don't just give them a, a free gift real fast. 7.7. How much? 7.7. 7. 7. 7. So this is like a 93, 92 and a half percent here. Yep. For DDA. He starts with 5 watt, he makes an aggressive play. Oh, 6 watt, 5 watt. I like this move. Uh, this is the best way to play for a Gabbit, to try to win a Gabbit. I would still split with a 5 watt. Okay, 4 2, 2 down. Alright, if he rolls a 6 up, it's nice. Go so six. Can double hit. I double guess? hit with the deuce. <laughs> I think so. Well, you I could play that deuce quietly I also. Don't know. You can just do this. And but, now you just want to make the double. Idea, just, no, know, I think this is okay. I would, I would double hit. Anyway. You would? Yeah. I would have not at this score. I don't know. It was correct to double hit. Oh, it was. Forty. Oh, yeah. okay. I mean, like, you still. You I know, was thinking only because of the score I wouldn't do it. Yeah, but you know, like just because the, I want to make the know, defensive like five. Last, like, how much do you change your game? You know, you still are playing backgammon. You just want to make a good play. I was just thinking <laughs> because of the score, I just want to make the defensive five without being hit. Yeah, you know, but you I'm could still make the defensive on. five even after double hitting, right? Well, look what happened. He may not do it. I mean, yeah. Petko, I oh. mean, oh, it's five. Very bad, bad roll. roll. Bad roll. Extremely bad. Yeah. This is, uh, he has to hope that he rolls like a 6-3 now. One of the things that the computer tells us after a match is the luck factor. Who was luckier and by how much? Falafel, well, who do you think was luckier and by how much in this match? I think I would double hit. Well, certainly Didier is luckier. I mean, uh, look, I mean, uh, he stays out even on the two-point board. Do you think it's a big factor? Yeah, like obviously he won the last uh, 11 or 12 points of the match, so... It's Four clearly one-sided. Well, I think it was, you're right when you said that. He <laughs> um, used to play eight to four, I guess. With the four, red of four, okay. And like, now he's got this. Oh, he's got back the back game. game. He's got the back game. He's got the back game, but he doesn't have the timing. There's a <laughs> one doctor in this tournament that he's an expert in these games. His name is Dr. Shahab. <laughs> And he's an inventor of uh, these sort of games. He's very good at them. Four, three. You Four can cover three. and cover. Oh, I don't know about that. It is. But I don't know what else to do. <laughs> I mean, it's like interesting. I don't know. You have to cover, I think. And then you I, don't really have a good I know three. one thing here. For uh, DDA, if you rolls now, or an ace or a deuce or a three, so that's a three point. This I don't. And I know something else. If I'm DDI, I never double this. I might win the whole match without the cube. I <laughs> four. You can like run out and hit, but then yeah, you it just can hit. Actually, be a time game. No, it's good. It's good to hit. Now you don't hit anymore, though. Yeah. You have to time it just right, <laughs> Uh We're talking about timing here. What they mean is you need to be down a lot of pips in order to play a one-two back game and hold your board on the other side. Generally speaking, you need about 100 pips down to make this game work really, Double really well. Double threes is do. not so good. Double threes, but it hits. Yeah. It hits it's and okay. it slots, it slots it's the fine. eight and the nine. Yeah. It slots the eight and the nine. Yeah, it's still That's fine. what that does. You know, and good. now you can see that he's out time, basically. That's yeah. why it was okay to hit. Yeah, I mean, he still has... He's out time. I mean, he's just he like a really bad game here. Yeah, it's not a good game. We know that. So he needs now. Okay, this is a good roll. Actually, was did he stay out? Would have been interesting. Two four. Yeah, two four. He needs to do that. He needs to hit on the seventeen if he can. Badly, yeah. badly, badly. Otherwise, it would be, uh, you know, it would really get bad quickly. It yeah. is already very dangerous. Yeah, six, six four. four can hit. Twice. Twice? Yeah, twice. Just so that you can gain some time. Yeah, yeah that twice. could be the right idea. This is also not crazy, actually. Yeah, this Just is okay, running. too. You this don't is okay. This Hitting on a deuce point is not I so think, good. Yeah, I think maybe just going so that he can't hit you. Hitting on a deuce is too deep, maybe, and you just really want to no, tie. Hitting twice time. is the right play, actually. This play? No, hitting twice. Hitting twice it's is the right play. A big mistake, yeah. Oh, wow. Pasco hits twice there real quick. You're yeah, the doctor. And I think the hitting twice just gives you time to either make right. the defensive three point or make, the seventeen point. You need point. to remake an anchor of some sort. Right, that was the idea of hitting twice. Yeah. Yeah. Because you don't want to get 
Six four. Six four. Makes the bar. Twice? No, no, no. Now Make you can roll double fives. No. No, not double fives, double. but he can roll like. No, he, doesn't uh, have a cracker. he doesn't have that many bad. I mean, now he rolled. I don't like that play. I think yeah, make the bar. Yeah, making the bar was much better. Making the bar was the right play. This was the wrong idea for the double hit. Um, the bar is just a solid double point fours. to have. Double fours. That was really bad. Oh, that's too fast. Really that's actually roll. fours. Yeah, this is uh, really bad now. Yeah. Now there's no more, more timing for anything. 6-2. Six, 6-2, two. Six, two, you can hit? You can hit, you can do yeah. this. Uh, I've been diff out I, okay. Yeah, coming out is okay because you yeah. have three men on back, you yeah. know. You yeah, just played yeah, it slow. Bad, you roll actually. double fours again. Bad. Now he will look to hit. Now he can hit. 6-2. Six, six, two. Not only yeah. does he hit, but he hits correctly. Yeah. Okay, so this is like a huge favor to, for a Gavin now. I mean, uh, yeah. Petko would be well served not to enter for a long time if he could help himself. 3-2, that's interesting. Uh, three. You ever hit there? No, you don't hit there. You don't, you don't hit there. You don't panic. Okay. He just crushes easily, you, just, you know. You just wait for him to crash. Yeah, you just wait for crash. All right. Yeah, that's reasonable. I think you hit now with a five if you could. Yeah, of course. I mean, you don't want him to anchor. Yeah. Yeah, you definitely don't want him to anchor. That is that is a fact. That is a fact. Ace three, now you cover if you can, and then he just crashes. Uh, this is like perfectly. You cover. You yeah, you cover. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you don't want to be too smart, genius. What did I tell you about that? Not, don't be too smart. What about just... No, genius. You cover and then you make the bar like yeah, a good boy. Yeah, covering is wrong, of course. What? <laughs> covering is wrong, of course. Covering was wrong? Substantial margin, yeah. Is Listen, it, genius. Is it, is it possible to be too smart? <laughs> uh, with the 5-2, yes? Yeah, with the 5-2. Where he covered? Yeah, it was wrong by a substantial margin. Really? Yeah. I guess the idea is just crash. You don't want to break the bar. Well, he crushes this way, too. I mean, he comes in with an ace, and then you don't have the bar. Excuse me, there's a bunch of Frenchmen making a lot of noise out there, but go ahead and make more. You're entitled. He's, he's winning. <laughs> Congratulations so far. I would have... I mean, I think, is this a one in a thousand shot genius? No. What, to save the gammon or to win? No, for the win. Is this one in 500? I think it's better. I think it's better. One in 200? I think you have more than the gammon save one per side. You can save this gammon a lot. Give a shot and save the gammon. That's true, actually. What am I saying? A lot of ways to save this gammon. But anyway, he crashed. Yeah, you can certainly save the he gammon. He crashed. Do you hit when an ace, genius? I don't know. Maybe. There it is. He hit. <laughs> I don't know. I don't actually know that one. I would not have hit there, I don't think. Uh, real quick, I was asked to explain something. I mentioned Petco's number one rating. It is right there. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah you, you just, you just win more games. Because you win more games. Uh, it doesn't change that much. It's like 2% no matter what you do. It's like 2% no matter what you do. It's a recording method to look at people's VR. It's currently in Victor Ashkenazi and Mochi do the list. And Falafel is way high up there also. Deuce. Yeah, the list, the BMAB list. <laughs> Let's not start. Yeah. Don't start. <laughs> well, you know, I've been missing in action yeah. for the last yeah. few years. You're and up there. Uh, now I'm like uh, looking to make a comeback. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like being a bit more active. Uh huh. Thank <laughs> Well, how about I give you two guys another weight bet and you don't have to play backgammon anymore? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you want to do it? Yeah, we, uh, <laughs> it looks like we got back close to our original weight, starting weight. How did that happen? I'm like, uh, I've increased my weight by like uh, 10% from the last time. All right, you, you're you 10% heavier than before and I'm like 10% lighter than before. Uh, all right. That sounds about right. <laughs> Like 280? Yeah, I'm about 280, 285, yeah. Yeah, but your pocketbook's gained some weight. <laughs> <laughs>
All right, let's see if we get a shot. Oh, wow. So this is a very safe bear off. You can still rebuild it. If he doubles, that's a bad idea, I think. You just have a free roll for a gamut. Yeah, I mean, Peko would be happy to pass. <laughs> or he could take. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think so. He could, think so? Take, he could take uh, maybe if, uh, if he could redouble to 16. Ah. <laughs> Maybe. Or to eight. No. <laughs> you take it, you redouble to eight. If you can redouble to eight, though. I think even if you can redouble to 16, it's still a pass, yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I don't think so. I beg to differ with that one. Uh, I think, I think, think it's actually a pass. You don't, you, don't, you think it's a pass if you could play this for the batch? Yeah. Are you crazy? So you were asking if it's 500 to one, and now you want to play for the match? Well, I can win this game. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I have, like I have like 7%. Yeah. I have like 7% to win it, don't I? You got 3% so. to win this game. I mean, maybe now. Maybe more. Maybe no, now. I, I get a shot. I, I you get a shot, you hit, you lose. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I, say this is, I say this is 3%. <laughs> it's very unlikely. Yeah. It's extremely yeah. unlikely maybe to win five. from here. Maybe 5 <laughs> I would, I mean, if I was Petco, I would like... I would not. I would pass. You would pass? <laughs> Position to play for the match from this score? First he has to leave a shot, which doesn't always happen. Yeah, then he can <laughs> rebuild, he can make a six point board. Yeah, he could. No I mean, shot. if he, if he, right, I mean, if he leaves a shot and gets hit, yeah. he can remake the board, close him out. Yeah, he could. He's a big favorite. Yeah, how Five, big four? parlay is that? Five, six. Oh, that doesn't, okay. What is he roll? Five six there? Any two high oh, six, numbers. Three. Any two high numbers. Yeah, he can get hit here, and then he can re like make the board, and you know what happens, genius. Yeah, maybe it was a take to six. To sixteen, yes. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> it's like close. <laughs> All right. Uh, double fours? Or what is that? Four two. Okay. I mean, he's just trying to save a gammon, I guess. Yeah. Maybe hope to get a hit, he never gets a hit. Okay, now twos are bad. You know, somehow you can win the game if you hit two checkers. Four, four, one. He leaves, he leaves a shot with the deuce, you hit him, he rolls five, one, and then you hit the second man, you win the game. You double <laughs> before you hit the second man. You actually double. Double sixes! Double sixes. Oh, oh, that's big for the gamut also. He really needs to roll a deuce. You gotta yeah, roll a deuce. Then a, deuce a five, one. Badly. Deuces. No! No, that's not a deuce? 4 1. Oh, I thought that's a 5 2. Oh, no way. The one, we know where the one goes. Yeah, of course you have to do that. Oh, this is going to be lights out now. I would call a timeout now. <laughs> timeout, yeah. I take a break. Now. They really do that in the NBA. I've seen them do this. Take a break so he misses the free throw. <laughs> You're up by 12 points with uh, five gotta, seconds to go. Look at how much he's shaking those dice. Two, two, one, hey, hey, hey. one, two. Hey. Oh, two, one. Oh. Yeah. No. Wait, he can still save the Gavin. He can still save the Gavin. <laughs> he can save the Gavin. Why did he give up? <laughs> the Gavin is not Jim. Well, why did he give up? He can save the Gavin. Genius, tell him, come back. He can save it with double sixes. Oh my god.